now when we are combining linagliptin and uh, dapagliflozin now linagliptin is cardiovascular safe renal safe hepatic safe linagliptin will suppress glucose so again they have synergistic action here and they are complement they have complementary action acting on two different pathways now if you look at the studies with dapagliflozin or other sglt2 inhibitors there is a clear cut data to show that sglt2 inhibitors are useful in reducing the mortality in people with established atherosclerotic cardiovascular disease people with heart failure people with advanced ckd and so on. so once you are using these this combination of molecules in people with established atherosclerotic cardiovascular disease or people with high risk of atherosclerotic cardiovascular disease these are the molecules of choice and they are recommended by almost every single guideline now linagliptin and uh, dapagliflozin both have uh, established uh, evidence or record on uh, cardiovascular safety and uh, both linagliptin also has uh, uh, rec- uh, enough evidence for cardiorenal safety they complement each other without uh, you know causing drug interaction uh so drug drug interaction chances are very low you have beneficial effects which are, which can combine both are <clears throat> having sufficient cardiovascular safety uh signals as well as benefits uh for cardiovascular outcomes so both of these can be combined it is very logical some of the important reason that patient discontinue or decrease the dosages of the drug is cost and the pill work so uh, and uh, this is the uh, very patients who are at elevated ascvd risks are the ones which are going to be benefited most by the uh, drugs individually and therefore combination will serve this purpose of uh, making it available at substantially uh, lower cost and uh, uh, less number of pills to be consumed in a day